Hey guys, computers are everywhere. Some people feel computers are too complex for them to use without special skills and knowledge. However, they interact with computers all the time without necessarily realizing it. Look closely. Computers are almost everywhere, not just in the conventional setup that includes a monitor, keyboard and mouse. They are also found in everyday devices such as mobile phones, lifts, televisions and cars. From such as mobile phones, sorry, from watching movies to playing games and even making dinner, computers can be used to do almost anything. Pressing the button on a microwave's control panel runs code on its internal microprocessor. Household Devices Many household devices contain computers. Selecting a program on a microwave, for example, actually runs a small program on the computer embedded in the device. Hardware and Software The physical parts of a computer are called hardware. These include things we can see, such as the monitor and computer case, as well as things we cannot see, such as the motherboard and microprocessor inside the computer case. Things like programs, the operating system, and firmware, a type of program that is embedded into the microprocessor, are called software. They allow users to access the capabilities of the hardware. Next we have input devices. There are a lot of ways to input information and interact with software running on a computer. The most common ways to do this are by using a keyboard, a mouse or a touch screen. Looking for files. Searching for files on a computer is similar to finding them in a real world filling cabinet the file system on a computer is usually accessed using a window containing small icons of folders or documents a folder can be opened to display the files inside by touching with a finger on a touch screen or double clicking with a mouse or trackpad how you can search a file the best way to look for a file is to find the magnifying glass icon then click on it and type the file name or keyword in the search bar image viewer and text viewer you can see so opening files and in the bin also for the moving data you use your usb drive your memory card removable hard disk So I'll see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye for now.